I want to talk about the uh, warfare that is happening within us. Have anyone ever noticed that the real warfare is with you and not with anybody else or anything else, but it's inside of you? Anybody ever notice that? It's amazing to know that the warfare is with me, inside of me, and it has nothing to do with anyone else. It's like something can happen, the mind get busy, and you feel the conflict, you feel the whatever it is you're going through, and you want to blame someone else for the way you feel when they really have nothing to do with it, even if they try to have something to do with it. Can we talk a little bit about that video, the last video you did with the, the girl, with the relationship? I don't remember her name. Uh, on, the, on the father's state? Yes. Yes. The one, the young lady that gave advice to men about relationships? Yes. Me? Right. Yes. So my comment is, I thought she was like really putting down women's, like she, she just, I got so upset looking at it because it was like, <laughs> it was like she was insane. Anything positive about women? About women? Yeah. This this woman wasn't saying anything positive about other women. No, she wasn't. Oh. She was just like kind of putting us down, like making it sound like all of us are like that. Oh, and you got upset. Mm-hmm. Did she mention your name? No, she didn't. But <laughs> I'm a woman, so it sounded like I mean, it's it like not, she was you're talking not about every all woman, of us. Are you? No, but she didn't say some woman. Remember that She's song, like, I'm every woman? <laughs> it's all in me. That's not Whitney Houston. Shaka Khan made that song first. Yeah. But, so what'd you learn from that by getting Nothing. it up there? Nothing. Okay, here's the lesson. <laughs> she was not talking about you. She didn't say your name. And you're not every woman. Well, maybe she should have said some women's, not no, all. No, it, it needed to happen. Once again, that needed to happen because Satan said, look at this woman. She's talking about every woman, and that includes you. And you're like, yes, Daddy, you are right. No, I'm I upset. didn't thought that. But when no. you got upset, you were saying yes to your Daddy. No, I got upset because she's talking about how to be in a relationship, and then it's not... To me, it's like if you're going to talk about something, then you should be in that position. Why? You know, because how are you going to give advice on something that you're not even in? She's not married. You don't have to be married to give advice on marriage. Okay. Do you disagree? I disagree. Jesus wasn't married. But she's not Jesus. She's his daughter. Okay. You, didn't, you weren't even hard on her. Like, you were hard on everybody else. <laughs> you were so easy with her. <laughs> because she was telling the truth. That was my favorite kiss. That was your favorite. But the, the, yeah, the lesson in this, uh, she wasn't talking about you, even if it sounded like, see, Lachis said, you don't have to, every time, you don't have to say not all, not all, not all, not all, but most, right? But if she didn't say that, you know you well enough to know she wasn't talking about you. I know, she was, I know she was not talking about me. But you got upset, but though. she was talking about females, and she made it sound like they're the worst thing on this planet. I don't even remember her saying all that. Huh? What did she well, say about females? Well, then go back and look at the video. Yeah, I'm going to have to go back yeah. and look, because I see all kind of so responses. So you were really nice to her. What, well, thank you. Because <laughs> <laughs> normally they say I'm not nice to women. What did she say that felt like she was, that was wrong. One thing. One thing, okay, let me think about it. I'll come back to it. Yeah, think of one thing she said that was wrong. I'll come back to it. Okay. I like that because it's wrong to identify with everybody. You, you, you're not everybody. You know what I'm saying? And so a person shouldn't have to say, not all, not all. Because common sense says there are exceptions to the rules in everything, right? And so, so they say all men, are, if someone said all men are weak, I'm not going to get upset and think she's talking about me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. Okay, she used the B word. She said women's are beads. Right. And that's not true. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not true. You say it is true? Where's it's the mic for her? Here. I thought, where's Esteban with the mic? 
What a lazy Mexican. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Well, I'm saying it is. You said all women are bees? Yes. Why do you say that? Does that include you? Yeah. And, <laughs> and it's I'm not, glad and, you and recognize again, that. And again, it's not, it's, it's just like the reaction. You know, if you're not reacting, then you're not a bee. But when you react, the, and, and women, they say, oh, this, they think they're so nice. But you say the wrong thing, and you will see it just jumps out. And it's not under their conscious control at all. So what do you say about this young lady saying that all women are like that? That's, that's not true, Mary. Do you know a woman who is not like that? Me? Oh, I was hoping you saying <laughs> so, so she's saying it's So if she's saying it's her, then why is she reacting so with right, these so people so at work? Right, so you know it's not you, and you're not like that, why does it bother you that this woman said it? I guess it bothered me because you were so nice to her. Uh, you didn't give her a hard time like you give everybody else a hard time that you interview. I give all other men and women a hard time no, except not, for this one. This one you didn't. <laughs> you didn't. You didn't ask her, do you have anger? You didn't ask her that. You asked but almost I can't, everybody that. I, I have to go with this flow. I can't. You know, I can't do the same thing every time mm -hmm. with everybody, mm -hmm. you know. But, so you, but you're not like that. Have you ever been that way? A bee? Uh, when I had to defend myself, yeah. So you were like that? <laughs> yes. And so if you have to defend yourself now, would that come out? No. Oh, it's not I mean, if somebody, if someone trying to hurt me, someone hit me yeah. or something like that, then I have to be like that, but I'm you not. You have to be that way. I have to be that way. So to if someone myself. hit you, tried to hurt you, then the bee will come out. Well, it's not the bee. It's a, it's. I don't. I wouldn't say like. I wouldn't say the bee will come out. I would say the other person or the person who needs to defend himself will come out. Oh. And that's not being a bee but because the other you're, person shouldn't even be there. It should only be one person there. Well, I mean, not the other person. But the if you get identity. upset, if someone gets you upset. That doesn't mean that you're being a bee because you're upset. It just means that you're defending yourself. But you can defend yourself without being upset. As a matter of fact, you have more authority when you defend yourself without being upset. When you are upset and defend yourself, you're losing. So if someone hits you, you're not supposed to get upset? Right. <laughs> you're supposed to stay still and knock them cold. Otherwise, you get upset, you're going to lose sight, and they'll knock you cold. Because you lose, you know how you get mad, like your mama used to say, girl, you making me, you better go sit down, I'm so mad, I'm blind right now. Mm -hmm. Remember that? Yeah. That's what anger does. And then you lose. Karate people would teach you, don't get upset, stay calm, so you can get rid of your opponent. Is that right? Yeah, they, they teach you not to get upset. And God doesn't want you to be upset because if you're not upset, you can see how to overcome your enemy. Otherwise, your enemy will overtake you. But I'll take a look at the video and see how nice I was. Anybody else saw the video yet? Have seen it? Oh, was I nice? Um, I think you're always nice. Oh, thank I, you. As far as uh, uh, being... <laughs> Right, you know, right with your point. How did I, I think treat nice, that lady okay. for the interview? So this is what I see from this. If if you, all women are bitches, and if it if it, there's a saying in Finnish that if, if it's the dog that barks, that was hit. So yeah. if that's what it brings out of you, then you are it, and that part still has not died. Your ego has to suffer through that and die. Right. I was, I was happy to see a woman telling the absolute truth about situations. You don't normally see that. She was telling the, you know, the truth. You know what I mean? No. You don't? No. Oh, okay. yeah. I'm going to watch it. I'm going to have to watch it again, all right? Because I don't remember. So what did you think about it? Take the mic for me. I don't, I don't think she gave you a reason to engage her. 
she was like you said she was straightforward right and uh it wasn't like other guests that start spinning around questions and you right. gotta go after them so yeah she was answering the questions and you notice that apparently she answered the questions yeah right if someone is answering the question i don't need to be hard on them only the people who try to skirt around the questions now am i judging her for like oh i'm sorry hold on <clears throat> am i judging her i know she not judge but But, okay, so the outfit she had on with the oh, low Lord. cleavage. No, <laughs> just, no, the dress she had on. I mean, the dress was above her knee and low cut dress. And, right. I mean, and she's talking about conservatives. So that was my other thing. It's like, you're talking about man's like conservative woman and here you are, you know. Oh, you didn't like the dress? Nope. The guys love the dress. I'm pretty sure they did. <laughs> <laughs> what's your point about, what's your question about the dress? No, I'm just saying, okay, so what is conservative? What does conservative mean? She said man's like conservative women, so. Men like conservative women. That's what she said. They do. It, do you man, think she was a, being conservative? I don't know. That's a good question, too. I didn't pay a lot of attention. I do remember the guys being all happy about the dress. The workers, sure they were. They were all happy. <laughs> uh, yes. Yeah. Um, I was going to say about that dress too because that was one thing that stood out for me too. But then what I did is this is my issue. This is the part of me that has to die. I noticed it, and I'm like, hmm, that's interesting. It what was wrong with the dress? Nothing wrong. It was just it was not conservative enough. Cleavage was showing it oh. nicely, you know. She's a pretty lady. Maybe. <laughs> but maybe uh, that's why I was a hard on her. Exactly. But that. <laughs> <laughs> she had but, on the right oh. kind of dress. <laughs> but but see what I what I did. I may have been hypnotized. <laughs> But when I noticed that, I went. <laughs> oh God! I went inside and I said, "Okay, this is my issue. It's not what she's wearing. It's why did I notice that versus something oh, else?" Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you didn't I, get mad about the dress. No, oh. I just was a little surprised. But like I said, then I realized it was my my problem, not hers. Oh, okay. You know what I'm That's a good point. So maybe I was hypnotized. <laughs> I'm sitting there like, "Okay, go ahead. Yeah. You're right." And I'm thinking, what a nice dress. <laughs> yes, Mary. Yes. Now, you hear Marilyn talking about the woman's dress? Yeah. Did you see the dress Marilyn had on last week? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> 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 it was way above the knee, had all kind of holes in it. And just, you know, it was like, oh, <laughs> that was not a conservative dress. Okay. If you were covered up, how did she see it? Because she was looking. No, I wasn't. <laughs> it was open. It was like, you know. Oh, God. Really short. It had little now, holes all around. I'm like, oh. Now you got me wanting to watch the show again. <laughs> I'm about to go back and watch that one. James, you saw it, right? No, I haven't seen it. You haven't seen it. You will not, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Marilyn is talking about the Fallen State.tv. I have a TV show, so check it out. <laughs> 